it's your girl CG on Trin and I am back today with a wig review but this wig review is special because it's because it is the first wig review that I am doing for love me hair yay and getting compensated for it so don't forget to go ahead and like this video just go ahead and like it now because that is how a girl will get her coins okay so I decided to keep the first wig a little simple. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna unbox her. There are two wigs in this box. So um, I'm gonna do one tonight and then you'll get another one later on next week or whatever. But I'm gonna go ahead and do one tonight. So the, first, the wig that I'm going to do tonight is, and I will leave all of the descriptions down in the description box below. If you've never ordered from Love Me, um, you, Girl, I'm a, I'm a sucker for a purple box, okay? Your wig comes also in a purple bag, so it's easy to store. Once, you have, once you're done with your wig, you can always restore it in your purple bag. Also, in your box of goodies, um, they do send you a little message that says, enjoy your wig from Helena, the founder of Love Me Hair. And you get a wig cap, which I don't need because I'm gonna rock this black one today because this wig is a full wig. You also get a little Love Me bag and it has a satin scarf, like an edge scarf. You get a Love Me clip. You also get some bobby pins and you get an elastic band if you wanna use it for one of um, a wig or something. But you get all of that in your box along with an instruction card on how to take care of your wig. So yeah, Love Me sends you the goodies when they send you a wig. So the wig that I have for you today in this bag, it is the um, silk base top. And if you see me looking down, I'm looking at the order. It's the silk base top bob wig with bangs. So, Let's take it out and I'll show you a picture of what the wig looks like looks like on the website. So let's take it out of the bog. And first look, we're gonna have to work on Sister Girl because she not ready. She not ready. But here is the wig, and you get the bob effect. You see, this is human hair also. So, you know, we're going to have to go in here and flat iron this wig, but it is a cute little bob wig with some bangs on the inside of the wig, the cap construction, there's two combs on the side, which I may cut out. Um, there is the adjustable straps and there's also an elastic band on the inside of the unit for a more secure fit. But yeah, this is a full wig, so this is gonna be really simple. There's also a silk top to this wig, so you can go in and what I may do is put a little even tint spray in there just to kind of give it a scalpy look. Here's what she looks like. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to lower you guys and put her on my wig head, finesse her up, and then I'll come back. So her. as you can see with her on my mannequin head, she looks a little matronly. And it's because of the packaging, you know, she was all kind of bent up and balled up in that packaging. But we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna fix her up really good. Um, and we're gonna go ahead and flat iron her. So I have my Love Me Flat Iron, which I got when I purchased another unit from Love Me, um, which I still have yet to review that wig. But I have a Love Me Flat Iron, and the Flat Iron, it's a flat iron on this side, but then if you adjust it here, it's a cr crimping iron on that side. So it's really cool. cool. It's actually like a two-in-one flat iron. So yeah, we're going to try this my first time using it. I'm also going to use my high comb as well to tame any flyaways that we get in um, this unit because we want her to be straight and laid.
and she has body, y'all. What I'm gonna do now is I'm, before I put it on my head, I'm gonna take some um, Cantu, my Cantu wax stick, and I'm just gonna like lay these flyaways down. Like there are plenty of flyaways here, um, and that's to be expected. And I'm gonna take my red hot comb and just run through the unit. Just run through it with the hot comb. Okay, so now we're gonna come back and we're going to install the unit. Y'all saw me go in and flat, flat iron hers um, while on my mannequin head and now we're gonna go ahead and install her. Okay, I'm gonna give her some brushes, go over it a, a bit with the brush and see what we need to do. Now, the style, I'm digging. Um, I wanna say I saw Taraji P. Henson with this same style um, on a picture and I've always wanted a bob like that, which is why I got this bob to begin with, because I was like, ooh, I wanna try it. So, it doesn't look too bad. Um, it's, it's really all secure. It's not going anywhere. It's, it's on one. I can shake and it not go anywhere. Okay guys, so here is what the final product looks like. I did cut the bangs a little bit and I actually shifted the wig back just a little bit so that I wouldn't have to cut off too much because this is where I want my bangs to lay. The unit is, the pros about the unit is it does not shed. It is a short unit, it's human hair. So you're not gonna get in any shedding from this unit. The bangs are really cute. It's not itchy. I'm not getting that itchy vibe that I get when I wear some of my synthetic wigs. Um, the bang is also very nice, very neatly done. So kudos to Love Me Hair for doing that. Um, I have noticed that maybe like on one side, the density is a little bit more, but I'm still getting, you know, I'm still getting body yada yada. If you want, you can also feather your bang a little bit. I think that that is a cute little look. This is the perfect everyday go to work, slap this on your head wig. It's very easy, very beginner friendly. Like I, I did not put any concealer at the top of the part like I said I would, but I mean, if I wear it to work or something, I probably would just to kind of, you know, make it look like a little scalpiana up here, but other than that, I think if you can feather the bang, that's really cute. You can tuck some behind your ear and, you know, wear it like this. This is the perfect everyday wig and I am so here for it. So Love Me Hair did a really good job. The hair is soft, the hair is neat. You can wear it straight out the pack. You don't have to wash it. You can if you want, if that's your thing, you can do that, but you don't have to. Um, I'll do a 360. Let me just brush it down for you guys and I'll do a 360 so that you can see. I, I'm loving it like this. Do a 360. So you can see what it looks like. Hopefully I did a good job curling. Like I said, I would definitely curl this. If you have a mannequin head, I would definitely go start by flat ironing on your mannequin head and then you know, putting it on and then you can just finesse it from here. I think this is a cute hairstyle for fedora. Look at that. It fits really cute. It looks good. Um, you can even, you know, wear it straight down if you just want to like do it like that. You know, you can wear it back um, to the back and then feather your bangs a little bit. You can also wear it with a baseball cap. I think that's a cute little look. You know, gives you a sporty vibe. So definitely you can rock this wig any way you want. All you need is your brush. Cause as you can see, once you take the hats off, you will get some flyaways. And then you can just brush those back down. But for a good, easy on the go wig, this is perfect. Perfect everyday wig. Perfect, perfect. Y'all might get tired of seeing this wig cause this gonna be my go-to wig. 
is too cute not to be i want to shout out to love me hair and thank them for sending me this unit um like i said i started with something simple so that you know y'all can see what it is that they have you know from all perspectives and this is a cute little bob that i picked out go ahead and like this video so that your girl can get her coins go ahead and like this video subscribe to my channel and i will definitely see you in my next video thank you guys bye